Some motors are rated in horsepower, some motors have wattage written on them, so they are directly not comparable or they're hard to do that, but it's actually, I'll show you how it's done. Look at the nameplate on this motor here. It says 120 volt, 2.3 amps, and they calculated that it's 250 watts. Okay, volts multiplied by amps will equal watts. Now if you multiply 120 with 2.3, you're gonna get about 280. So what they did is because 120 is nominal, uh, but at the end of the extension cord, at the end of the garage, uh, half, however far away you are from the breaker panel, you may only get 110. So they went, just to be safe, 110 times 2.3, that's close enough to 250. 250 watts now. How does that 250 watts compare to, or uh, uh, become a third of a horsepower? See, it's fairly straightforward. Take a look at this one. One, there, one horsepower electrical is 745 watts plus change. So you just take the 250. Getting there. 250 divided by 745 equals 0 0.333 and 0 0.3 converted from a decimal to a fraction is about a third a third horsepower so there's your math that's what you can do here is another one this one says 120 volts 3 amps so let's make it fair and level the grounds let's go with 110 110 times 3 is 330 watts and you do the same 330 divided by the 745 0.44. So it's uh, if this was if this was one third of a horsepower, this is two fifths of a horsepower if you like these fractions. So that's how you can go from watts to horsepower.